Hi guys, welcome back to Ron Pet Bath and Beauty. Um, this is a soap that um, is a repeat for me, a many repeat for me, um, but it is new to you guys. It's our Tough New and Shoe recipe. Um, I haven't put everything in here yet. <laughs> this is my powdered heavy cream. Woo! And because it's the Tough New and Shoe recipe, we have oatmeal. And I use baby oats. I love using baby oats because then you can really, really see it. Okay, and I gotta put my yogurt in there. But I wanted to um, get started with this to uh, let y'all know what it is. It is called Under the Sea, inspired by the song from The Little Mermaid. And yes, it is our mermaid soap. So let me get all of this blended up and then I'm going to add my uh, lye water. Okay, and we have to be careful with Judy. I think I've mentioned it uh, because if I keep her on for too long, my light flashes. <laughs> and that's not good for an epileptic. It's very, very not good. So in my lye water is just distilled water, sodium hydroxide, salt, and sugar. And of course, my salt and sugar is sticking. Okay, here we go. Okay, I am going to stick blend all of my colors. So this is at a very light emulsification, which is uh, what we need. I should take Judy out of here. Let's take Judy out of here. Because I have to, we're laying down um, the the bottom of the the soap. It's got to set up. The fragrance we're using is Blue Raspberry Slushy from Nature's Garden, and it smells so good, you guys. So good. But I am going to weigh it. Hopefully, I don't go too far over. Woo! Just a little bit over. I wanted 16 ounces. I got 17.10. <laughs> All right. Let's get the scale out of here because I don't need it anymore. Okay. Now I'm gonna move this up here. And like I said, all this, all the colors are gonna. Oh, excuse me. Reaching over you. Are gonna be stick blended. And I am gonna put fragrance in this bottom part. We don't need that much. So when, what are you doing? We just need a small bottom. And I, like I said, put fragrance in there. Oh, let's get our cup or our washcloth. Don't want that on my counter. I didn't, I'm telling you, some fragrance oils, they really, really, you could eat through your counter. Okay, here we go. There is our caramel. I think I might need another spatula. Actually, I could probably just wipe this one off, you guys. Hope everybody's doing well. I have still been super, super busy. I'm way behind on watching everybody's stuff, at least, you know, where I'm at right now. And my, uh, the dates today is September 14th so I'm also behind on just the YouTube in general you guys I haven't really commented back to anybody or anything and I really apologize I've just been super stupid busy <clears throat> so I will try to uh, be better about that let me uh, scrape 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 can't tell which one has more in it. Okay, so here is our sand at the bottom of our ocean. And I think I might have to get bigger buckets. I don't think that these little cups are going to do for the other colors that I'm using. So I guess I'm going to have to see if they do or not. Okay, 
Oh, let's put this back up here. And I'm going to move this to the stove where it is level. And hopefully that sets up well enough. Okay, so... Oh, I think I'm going to need bigger buckets. Okay, guys, hold on. Let me get bigger buckets. Okay, I tried to, woo, tried to scrape that bucket as much as possible. So I could uh, do my drop squirrel back in that bucket. I was really hoping I could use the smaller cups, but it's just not going to work. Oh my goodness, I didn't mix my titanium dioxide. Ugh. Hold on, guys. How do you forget to mix your titanium dioxide? It's probably because I was, you know, I was adding everything else separately. This has got the most in it. So that is getting the TV. And then we need purple. Oh, geez. I didn't even bring spoons over here. See, now I don't got to reach over you guys. Ugh. My fan is on. And I know there's a lot of commotion upstairs. Oh, this is new. Look at that. Um, my grandbabies are here. They, uh, I pick them up from school every day. They, they go to school down here. And their dad doesn't get off till 7, so. And I'm soaping right after dinner, so. So if you hear all the commotion upstairs, that is why. So that was Amethyst Purple. We are using Lapis Blue, which I know is new. Because I was completely out of this. I didn't realize that that amethyst purple was <clears throat> was new and then we're using turquoise which this old one we can just dump actually it might be enough color oh that's plenty I'm gonna leave that because there's still mica in there. Okay, so we're going to go latest to darkest, and I'll come back when uh, these are all mixed. Okay, I'm going to get Judy out of here. Ugh, get out of there. That way, I don't have to worry about it. Get all this cleaned off. Oh, nice. Nice, 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 nice. It's pretty thick. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm being really quiet. I'm. I apologize. I'm not being quiet on purpose. I promise. And I know you guys probably can't see all these buckets. Let me put this back. Let's check on these most. Let's check on this. Oh, not jiggling it at all. What do you know? I love it. Love it, love it. Okay, some in there, some in there, some in there, some in there. I love this fragrance. We make, this is one of the fragrance we make in bath bombs. And it sells like <laughs> in bath bombs. People absolutely love it. I love it too. It was um, actually the soap that I currently have in my bathroom, like at the sink. I like to put blues and whatnot because my bathroom is, it basically looks like Elsa threw up in it. <laughs> it's got the dark blue, the light blue, the silver, you know, that kind of stuff. My daughter, that was what she said when she first saw it. She was like, Mom, it looks like Elsa threw up in here. Okay, and then stir in here. I gotta move this, I can't quite reach it. Okay, so and then we're gonna do an in the pot swirl. I wanna leave some of the, la the reason there's more white and more lapis is because um, I do a thing on the top of it. You'll see. Just gonna pour some in. We're just gonna sort of swirl it in there as we're oh, as we're pouring it. Dang it! I just got the that uh, 
handle of my spatula on the spout. I hate it when I do that. And we need white, and I did it again. <laughs> Okay, and we're going to keep continuing to do this back and forth. of the purple and the last of the turquoise. God, I'm stopped. I'm not talking again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Concentrating. I just made myself a huge amount of dishes to do, you guys huge but that's all right the soap is worth it i made all the mermaid tails geez two weeks ago um because i had intended to do it to make this soap two weeks ago but i ran out of olive oil yet again so i had to order that and then there was winter stuff i had to make first yeah I'm going to busy, busy bee. Busy, busy bee. I'm going to put a little bit more blue in there. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take that turquoise bucket back. Because you know what I'm going to do? Oh, this would be... Ah, I'm making lots of work for myself, but I think it would be super, super cool. Okay, because I can use that. It doesn't matter. Let me pour some in here. My spatula because I don't want to uh, break through okay yeah I wasn't gonna break through no matter what I did okay this one's a little bit muddied up because I poured it twice, but it needed to be done. I couldn't have poured this when it was so full. So let me back this up, see if I can do this. Oh, I didn't bring you guys in closer. I'm so sorry. Now I'm making a big old mess. see what we got. This one could use a little bit more. It's actually not going to take me long to do what I need to do with this. <clears throat> okay. I'll bring you in closer now. No, it does need to go this way. Okay, so, oh, I just saw some air bubbles pop. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to alcohol these and wait for this to set up some and uh, we'll be back. Yep, I have a little bit extra. Oh, it's not even, it's not quite set up. A little bit of extra of the colored stuff. I'm probably going to put some of it in a cupcake holder and give it to Ava because she loves this one. So I'll put some on the sign. And then the rest of it will go in the cupcake holder. 
Let me spread it out some. Well, uh, yeah, see it's still not quite set up yet. I want to get it to the corners there because this is where, this is the side I'm going to put my mermaid tails on. And I probably should have turned this one around so I could put my mermaid tails where my marks are. Zoom in. Yeah, this is not, not set up. Okay, let me try to put the, let me see how the white and the blue are, because the white and the blue go on the other side. Oh, that's much more, much more set up. Got the blue in the middle. Or should I say mostly in the middle? It doesn't have to completely be in the middle. Ah! Lost them. Trying to scrape! I'm losing it! Okay. That one can go away, and then the white, which also still isn't completely set up, but it's even more than the blue, which is good. Whoop. What I like to try to do is sort of make it look like cresting waves. It doesn't always work out that way, but we try. As you can see, I'm getting color in my white. <laughs> that happens all the time. There we go. Let me scrape. I'm going to cut this out, then I'm going to scrape this white into this bucket. Okay, let's see if we can get this to make, get this to make it look like cresting waves. Let me just get all this white to the corner. And to the edge. Well, that's all the way to the corner and to the edge. Sometimes they have to go back and forth with it. It just depends on how it's feeling. <laughs> Whoa! Stay in there. Stay in the mold. You know, I did this soap first tonight because it does it, sometimes it takes me a hot second to, to get it right. There we go, that's better. I'm going to have to take my potato peeler to it. Let's do it that way then. Ah! Losing it on the side. that wave again. Again, I'm sorry I'm not talking. I promise I'll talk more with my, when I cut it. <laughs> this is one of those, you know, trying to get a right soap so it doesn't always work. I like to, like I said, make the waves look like they're cresting. I don't think I'm really happy with that, but that's about all I'm going to do for now. 
Let me grab my, oh, my mermaid tails. They are underneath you. We have purple ones. We have turquoise ones. And we have lapis blue ones. So, I have to take off my gloves to, to do these. Oh, some of them are broken. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. I just... I've had, like I said, I've had these over here for like two weeks. So... You know, I put stuff on them and whatnot. So, these tails are very fragile. I have to be very, very careful when I'm packaging them. Very, very careful when I'm packaging them. So that way it looks like the mermaid is just, you know, jumping in there. Oh, please be up higher. Let's put you up higher so I don't break you while I'm unmolding you. That would be good. This is the highest I've ever put the tails. Let's get some of these. I have more purple than I do anything because those are the ones that are the most requested, believe it or not. The purple ones. So, and this is my own melt and pour that I make. I'm going to try to finish this one off with the turquoise ones. Oh, see, that one just fell apart. I can hopefully I have enough tails I might have to make some more tails oh, this one is in one piece and then we just need the purple ones I mean, you guys get the idea right do I have to stay here this does believe it or not this doesn't get glittered either does not do no glitter on this one so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and um, put you guys forward to the cutting so I'll see you then bye bye okay guys we are gonna cut under the sea I'm only gonna cut this one loaf with you I have to be really really careful because look <laughs> let me pull this back my mermaid tails came off because I was uh, flopping it out of the mold so we gotta be really careful with this as a matter of fact I'm gonna turn it around so that those mermaid tails aren't facing me okay there's our end piece oh paper towel helpful how's, oh, how's everybody doing hopefully good as usual, I've had a busy week, but it's good. Being busy is not a bad thing, although sometimes I have to admit I get a, a teensy seat. I just knocked that with my wrist. I just lost another tail. Dang it. Ding dong, dang it. I gotta be super, super careful. It pretty much looks the same way throughout. What was I saying? before I broke that mermaid tail. Oh, you know what I am going to do? This probably wasn't what I was saying at all. Um, on the face of the soap, I'm going to, on the broken ones, I'm going to take the rest of the, the tail off of the top of it. Sort of dig it out, I guess, without messing up the soap too much. This is as much as possible. And I am going to attach um, with melt and pour a tail on the face of the soap so basically you know the tail would be here and then the rest of it would be on there although I think I'm gonna make them out of soap dough so yeah I mean you this is pretty much the same way through so I'm not gonna you know make y'all watch the whole thing or maybe I will I don't know because we get to hang out when I cut soap, right? Well, I love hanging out with y'all. 
And sometimes there's some different things in there. I love the way that the ocean, the oceany look goes. I told Lauren today, it was so funny, because I told her, I, you know, that uh, I was cutting this mm -hmm. today and that I broke so many of the tails off of one of them. And she says, well, you know, that was her idea to do the whole tail on the side thing. And I said to her, you know, well, what about the, the ones that we have made now? And she said, mom, we're out of it. <laughs> oh yeah, we are. But I'm still going to do the top the same. And, you know, I told Lily, I said, you know, once we get all caught up, I'll be able to do this soap without the actual mermaid tail mold. I'd like to actually pipe mermaid tails. You know, I have a very small, uh, like a Wilton, I think it's a Wilton 2 that would work to pipe some tails. And, you know, why not? And then we can stick them on, you know, I'd pipe them on to wax paper and then yeah we'd be good to go and then attach them that way so all right guys thanks for staying with me i appreciate it as always and i'll see you next time bye bye